Hey, so this is Scott. Yeah, and this is Jay. And this is Scott and Jay show, and it's Saturday, and it's an awesome day in Barnesville, <sighs> Oklahoma. It's sunny. Today. And 40, <coughs> 40, what, 46 degrees. Something, yeah, it's beautiful. It's cool. It's invigorating to drive over here. My convertible, you know, is just awesome. Yeah, me too. I've got a convertible seat. Look, top down. I got my top up now. I'm, I'm the Unabomber. <laughs> There is? Yeah. Right underneath. Up at the top. Oh, there's outlets underneath. Yeah. We're getting instructions here at Starbucks Holy Studios. Holy cow, about, we learned uh, something new. Wow. Yeah, let's not share that because <clears throat> this is our space. That's right. So, <clears throat> so we're here live at Starbucks Studios. We are here and, live. Uh, we just found out we have power sources it. and the underneath the, the bar here. That's cool. Yes, but you don't spread that around because this is the Scott and Jay Show studio here right. at the Starbucks, Starbucks studio. Studios. Yeah. And so on Saturday mornings, this is where, usually where we should be. Right. And if you're here, we're going to ask the bouncer to remove you so we can sit down. So Starbucks, <coughs> they got the new pink sleeves. What do you think about the pink sleeves, Jay? What do you think about them? I'm good at all. <laughs> And, and so then they got these little pink, uh, pink sacks. Anyway, not too hip on the pink. That's better. Yeah. Man, it was too hot. They have a new uh, almond croissant. Mm, Brand new. Healthy. So tell us about it, Scott. Right now, quick. Tell us right now. It is good. No, it's too late. Good. He had his mouth full, so that was the whole joke because he had his mouth full and. I wanted to talk with his mouth full, but it so, kind of ruined the joke, so. It's really good, actually. Ruined the bit. So you guys just go back and pay what? Vacay, yeah. We we only went to uh, places that end in the, in the E vowel sound. Um, so we went like to Kansas City. Kentucky? And No, not Kentucky. We went to Kansas City. Minnesota. And we went to Aurora, Missouri. Colorado. Missouri. California, yeah, no, and we went to uh, Tennessee, so Kansas City and Tennessee, okay, uh, Nash Nashville, <clears throat> Tennessee. Nashville. Uh, went went on a uh, anniversary trip with my wife. Uh, celebrated 18 years of uh, blissful marriage, marital bliss, with, with my uh, beautiful and wonderful bride wife uh, Diane. And 18 uh, happy years. That's you know, 18 out of 20. That's not bad. 18 out of 20 is not bad. So we didn't celebrate the other two that were horrible, but. <laughs> Oh. 18 so you went years to the Savoy. We went to the Savoy Grill. Man, it's a fantastic place. So if you're in Kansas City and you like it's really good. Um, 1930 atmosphere, uh, top notch, five star waiter, staff uh, type of restaurant, the Savoy Grill in downtown Kansas City is amazing. It's the oldest um, operating restaurant in Kansas City. Uh, a lot of the other places did not survive the um, the depression, but yeah. the Savoy Grill did. Um, so it's it's also uh, one of the favorite places of former president uh, deceased, obviously uh, Harry Truman. Truman often went there, uh, almost like a weekly basis. Uh, the uh, the uh, Savoy has also been known to house uh, Lyndon Johnson. Um, House Lyndon Johnson. Yes, uh, Lyndon Johnson frequented there, ate there a lot. Uh, Ronald Reagan also Ronald went Reagan. there. Nixon went there. Gerald Ford went there. Uh, there's a booth there. They call it the presidential booth. It's not distinguishable by any means, but it's the booth number four. Um, booth which number I, four at the Savoy. Yeah, I said there? booth five. I oh, said five? booth five. How yeah. can I say four? I uh, didn't know about it until after we had stopped and talked to a waiter about it a little bit. He kind of told us, and I also read it on uh, Wikipedia. Oh, cool. Uh, but anyway, that, that it's something that uh, you should definitely check out. It's uh, I highly recommend the uh, seafood grill. So uh, the sea seafood mixed grill. It came with swordfish, um, something else, snapper, I think, and uh, uh, salmon. Great stuff. And well, a side of, of uh, steamed veggies. While you were gone, my hearing went. Sorry, what was that? Yeah. Okay. My hearing went, so I can't hear out of this ear. It's, uh, the doctor said that I've got uh, 
water behind the uh, <coughs> your old <coughs> water behind the eardrum. That well, was that, Sandy? You got it cold. Speak up, son. You're mumbling. And so I can't. Uh, so it sounds like I'm talking into a can all the time. And that Does it sound to, like you're talking like this? Yeah. So this is Scott, and this is what he hears. And I have to turn the TV up really loud at home. <laughs> so last night, so that's what I said. and the TV's just <gasps> blaring. She's like, oh my God. I was like, I know, I can't hear it. So when I was at the doc doctor's office, she goes, you know, it'll be about Dr. Uh, you don't say. Oh. Fantastic. Yeah, I I say. Anyway, said uh, that it should go away. It, it won't be a quick uh, fix, probably about six weeks. Yeah. So if I turn my head like this, everything's fine. I can hear great. But the doctor said not to do that because, yeah, you look funny walking around like that. And then as I was leaving, she said, now don't remember, don't forget. Because you're don't 50. remember. Yeah. <laughs> because you're 50 now, don't forget you have to get your colonoscopy. Ooh, crap. <laughs> so I've got to get that scheduled. <laughs> oh, that's so much fun. Two days leading into that is just, oh. So we're putting that off, yeah. So I mean, that's a good way to lose weight right there. Yeah. Yeah. So got that to look forward to. That's awesome. Um, sports. Yeah, let's March turn to the Madness. sports desk. So the NCAA March Madness tournament's going on. Too bad Oklahoma. Yeah, all of our local schools are gone. OU, OSU, Tex yeah. Tulsa, uh, Everybody's out. Kansas State. The Big 12 got demolished. So the brackets, 95% um, of the brackets. So, are just so I think remaining Big 12 is Iowa State, Texas, and Kansas, I think. So who do you think will take it all? Baylor. Baylor. Sorry? Who's taking it all? Who's the winner? Man, I don't know. Uh, Wichita State looks really, really good. We watched a little bit of that game last night. Um, they Obviously, they didn't pay, play anybody, but you look at, at even the number one team struggled. I mean, Virginia last night at the half were down by like four or five, and, and uh, it looked for a second like we were going to see our first – uh, number 16 team knock off a number one team and um, it has truly been a March madness uh, last night a lot of fouls a lot of fouls on Oklahoma oh State oh my yes. god no okay so 61 something like that 61 fouls that was, that's ridiculous I mean this this right here constituted a uh, technical or not a technical but a, uh, an intentional foul and uh, that, that just is not right um, they just way they call it way too tight uh, in some areas. In some areas, you know, you could actually mug the guy and they wouldn't call it. Um, so that was that was insane, a little, a little wacky there. Yeah, and so that that really hurt OSU. Um, so you're calling Wichita State all the way? I, it'd be hard not to, at this point not to call them all the way. Okay, um, there you go. So Jay Stump has predicted Wichita State. You heard it first here at Scott J. Show. Yeah, but it's so so one of the one amazing stat. There has already been six overtime games in uh, the first round. Uh, that's more overtime games in the last two years, and that was through the entire tournament. And this is just through the first round, and uh, the. Uh, Virginia Commonwealth, and uh, I forget who they were playing now. Oh, uh, uh, Austin, uh, SFA, uh, forgot their name of, of the school, SFA. Last second, 3.6 3 seconds left. They're down by four, shoots a three, and was fouled. Goes to the line, hits the free throw, take it into overtime. At one point, SFA was trailing by like 10 points. But they brought, battled back, three seconds left, they hit a desperation three, and he was fouled. They get the extra point, and he yeah, goes I feel like I'm there. Hmm? I feel like I'm there listening to you. Yeah, it was great. Did, did you see the Reds pitcher get hit in the head with a line drive, 110 mile? No, right, right now it's all basketball for me. I haven't oh. really been watching. And it's yeah. preseason, so yeah. I mean, I haven't been watching baseball. Cardinals much. up to bat, Reds pitcher, Al Gross. Something or other throws the ball, comes off the bat, line drive right over the left eye, hits him, throws him back on his back, and uh, yeah, fractured his over his left eye. Didn't knock him out, but uh, it's amazing. Uh, wow. Yeah. 
the video is pretty gruesome, actually. So you can hear from the from the stadium seats, you can hear the melon. <laughs> It's pretty bad. <coughs> so, yeah. Starbucks has a new app. Get used to it. It's really cool. You can pay. It's just got a new format, a new way of looking at it. Uh, you can shake your phone to uh, get the pay. Oh, I didn't know you could shake your phone. Yeah, you can shake That's your phone to, to get the uh, pay thing, the uh, barcode up. Yeah. And uh, it has a new look, uh, a new little uh, user new interface. New look, new feel. Yeah, it's, um, it's, 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 still, it's still the same good old Starbucks app. And uh, yeah, so and you can put it. your picture. You can you can sign in yeah. with Facebook, and you can put your picture there's, up there. There's the obligatory bad app. No, you gotta close that first. Now shake it. Shake, shake, shake. There you go. <coughs> In the movie news, turning to the movie desk now, uh, out for uh, on DVD now and up for rent at least on iTunes that I saw and then we did uh, Saving Mr. Banks by Disney. Tom, oh, sorry, yeah. Tom Hanks. And, Gotta see uh, that one. Gotta see that. I haven't seen that gal. I forgot what her name is. Yeah, Emma Thompson. Emma Thompson. Yeah. Did an incredible job, Emma Thompson. Did. So you highly recommend it. We want to go buy it. Yeah. Yeah. It was it. it was an amazing amazing movie. Um, you know, if you are a fan of Disney yeah. and if you which it's very do historic. you know anybody that's a fan of Disney? Do you know anybody? Uh, I might be able to think of somebody. Okay, I, I might be able to think of one. Another somebody. person, maybe. Yeah, that, that's like a fanatic. Um, <laughs> but if you can think of anybody that is just an absolute fanatic, it's a must-have. It's a must-have. Uh, movie. Plus, Hist- if, historical Tom Hanks. If always, you love, if you grew up and, and loved Besides and sang Hill. often, it, it, just a spoonful of sugar. Uh, helps the medicine go down. If or you if you love Mary Poppins, Poppins a bag. Oh, you have to go see. You have to see this movie. It's, it's incredible. You, you'll you'll see uh, you'll see the movie and it's so they did Dick life. Van Dyke. Did they do Dick Van Dyke. They did not do a Dick Van Dyke oh. uh, impersonator. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Did they do a Julie Andrews? No. Oh. No, they they didn't get to the cast. Oh, okay. Um, other than you know the Tom Hanks and the uh, two brothers that yeah. did the, the Sherman scores. brothers, yeah, yeah, they they were just that's great. B.J. Novak did a great job. Yeah, we're into uh, we're starting the Mad Men series, so time to watch Wookies. Yeah, uh, the Mad Men series, which is really interesting. It's pretty cool. It's pretty good. It's actually pretty tame compared to some of the stuff that's out there right now, like Game of Thrones and House of Cards with Walking Dead, Walking and Dead. And Break Blow your band. brains out. Yeah. Great, great, wholesome. Yeah, good family. Awesome family. Yeah, get around. The feel TV. good. Yeah, feel good. Yeah. Uh, just you know, started out. They stuck here. Three oh five down to two fifteen. Yeah. Two fifteen consistently. Um, I I've actually um, yesterday I weighed in at two twelve. So I forgot to weigh in this morning, but. So this was uh, over a course of now a year and about about eighteen eight, uh, about eighteen months. Eighteen months. Yeah. Um, so Bartlesville, we're helping you go on a diet. We're going to help you lose some weight. We're going to help you feel better. So what's the one thing that we in Bartlesville can do this week? Focus on to lead a healthier lifestyle. What's one thing to say no to dairy? Say no to dairy. Yes. Like no milk. No milk, no cheese. So what if I want milk? What if I have cereal? What if I want there are some good milk alternatives like almond, almond milk. milk. Yeah. Um, I don't like soy milk, but a lot of people do like soy milk. It's usually flavored, but almond milk is really, really good. Yeah. Um, you know, it's, so it's no different, milk? but um, there's a lot of stuff that's in milk that just is not healthy. There's a lot of fats in milk that are, are not a healthy fat to, to ingest. You know, I've, I've seen a lot, a lot of steroids, chemicals. Uh, yeah, a lot of steroids, yeah. chemicals, and all that. And, um, if you ever looked at a cow, you'll notice they're fat. So, uh... oh, my trip. I think we've hit yeah. it. No, my new, my my trip. Um, that. Oh yeah. So I was oh, telling yeah. you oh, about yeah. this. You know, we're driving home, and all of a sudden, this truck goes left 